This program is brought to you by BAEAEAF, the Cable Company. Hey, welcome to Stuff to Stuff Kids Mind. Mind to blow your. My name is Robert Lamb. And my name is Julie Douglas, and today we are talking about yes. electricity. You know, it's carpeted floor, you shuffle across a static like you reach out and you touch a door, and there's that spark, that shock. That spark. But before, 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 we have to talk about atoms. Now everything we see is made up of atoms, and right here we have atoms, nation of a couple of atoms hanging out. Now atoms are composed of protons, neutrons, and most importantly, electrons. Our representations of the atom, our atom, mine has two. And mine also has two. One, normally atoms are neutrally charged, and they have the same amount of electrons and electrons. That's what you see here. But what happens when these two atoms rub against each other? So to look at this a little bit more, we're going to do a simple experiment with a balloon in your hair. That's right. That's right. Helium balloon here. But the that's right. Use can just be a normal filled with air. It doesn't matter. But Julie, if you will take that. Oh, uh, with pleasure. Okay. So you just want to rub the hair really, 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 really well. well. Get a lot of static built up, and then. Voila, look at that. Um, it's pretty great. It's pretty great. It's pretty great. It's pretty great. Let's get a nice loud cap. No. And what you have here is an exchange of those electrons to Robert's hair. And the reason why Robert's hair is sticking up so very well is that now all those little hairs are positive Robert's hair. And they are Robert's hair. That's why they're standing on Robert's hair to get away from one another. So there you have it, electricity. And uh, in our next segment, we're going to start to talk about next segment. In our experiment, we were able to observe how this spark jumps from a positively charged atom to a negatively charged atom. And we can actually observe this happening in the world around us. If I shuffle across a carpeted floor, and then I reach out and I touch a doorknob, this happens during an electrical storm in the sky. That's right, in the form of lightning, because it's basically the same process. What you have is you have a cloud that has positively charged particles on the top and negatively charged particles on the bottom. And all those particles begin to collide with each other, rub up against each other, and it creates static electricity. Here on Earth. The tips of your fingers? That's not only a great way to shock your sister. <laughs> Funny joke. Shock your sister. Dish and shit world. <laughs> I'm on death battle. Stinky wings! Somebody ring the dinkster! <laughs>